Hey guys, um, this is a one long ass video. Leon, how you holding up? Um, so no, now we're at the village, and this part can be a little tough for those who's playing this game for the first time because um, of the amount of enemies that you have to kill uh, in order to survive. Now, after you grab this herb, uh. Go near that house and stop running. Instead, walk and hug that wall. If you do that, um, the Ganado won't notice you. I also like to mention that in this video, I do get hit once, but really, I mean, I think it's okay and makes sense if you get hit at least once or twice in this video, in this part, because I mean, there's so many enemies and it's just nearly impossible to get do this area without getting hit once or twice. So right now you're seeing me um, killing the extra chainsaw guy and you really don't have to kill him at all but I liked it because well for one it's fun killing shit and secondly uh, you get a nice reward. It's either a ruby or a 10,000 gold. So the trick with this guy is you want to fake him out uh, into trying to swing at you and as soon as he's done swinging, uh, shoot him in the head with a pistol, and that'll usually stagger him. That'll always stagger him. You can use your knife here if you want, but I mean, uh, it it kills him much easier if you use your handgun. Now that's kind of a mistake I made. I was just a little lucky, so I didn't get hit. But don't use your flame grenade too close. You might burn yourself instead if you do that. Oh, you're yeah, back then I should use my handgun there. I instead got strangled because I used my knife. Okay, so now that um, we killed that chainsaw guy, uh, run into this house right here, and this is the house with the shotgun. I am for the trust. Why these people? Yeah, Leon's becoming more popular. <laughs> Bitch! Okay, so now run into this house and pick up the shotgun. Now you want to get out of this house quickly because the chainsaw guy can. Uh, break through your house or uh, climb up the ladder. <laughs> now, what I like to do is um, camp at this house right here. And pretty much we're just going to use the door to our advantage, really. I mean, by doing this, um, you have a, a lot less likely chance of getting hit. Okay, so as soon as you hear the chainsaw guy coming in, um, equip your shotgun and wait for uh, the group to open the door. I know it's not the most exciting way, I know it's not the um, fun, most fun way, but uh, it's the best way. I mean, like I said earlier, by doing this, you don't have to, get, you don't have to worry about getting hit that much. Also, keep your shotgun uh, fully loaded. Um, one time when I was doing this trick, um, I forgot to reload, uh, and I, I the chain when the chainsaw guy came in, I had to reload, and uh, the guy bit the shit out. Uh, I mean, I mean, cut my head off. <laughs> hmm. So, um, just keep your shotgun reloaded, and don't make my past mistake. Also, if you do this, um, you, you can kill so many enemies just in one shot like that, or two rather. Um, it gives you a really big advantage. Like right there, you got a ton of items right there. Oh, 
Also, try to aim at the doctor's. Uh, when you're trying to shoot at Doctor Salva Salvador, try to aim for his head because uh, obviously that's where he'll where he'll inflict the most amount of damage. And the guy's down for the count. Also, I like to thank Mr. Blonde Productions for um, that strategy. It was really kind of useful. Um, I used that strategy when uh, I was at the beginning of the game. So, for the rest of this video, just pretty much kill all the villagers and that's pretty much all there is to it. Also, try not to use any grenades here. I mean, um, unless if you're really desperate and there's a whole mob after you, just don't bother using the grenade. Oh wow, there, there's the cutscene. But like I said, throughout the whole level, try to avoid using the, sh um, the grenades at all times. That is, after I use the flame grenade on the chainsaw guy. Lord Sattler. So, these guys are pretty much scared of Leon, and he wants they want to go to church and pray that uh, Leon doesn't come after them and eat their heads off. I'm just kidding. Where's everyone going? Bingo? So now it's a ghost town. Or is it? What's well, close to it? Honigan, I have some bad news. I've confirmed the body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Alright, so, um, now, pretty much, loot the whole village like a madman. I'd also like to point out to you guys that um, next time you face Dr. Salvador, um, you're most likely going to see me using <coughs> using a handgun instead of the shotgun, like I did in this video. Because I think, well, just that the shotgun ammo is really, really valuable throughout the whole game, and uh, it's really easy to low run low run low on ammo on it. So after a few more houses, uh, we're pretty much done for the village. And after this part, um, things get a little mo a little more easier. So stay tuned. <laughs> 